The digital healthcare sector is one of the most exciting I've seen. To apply cutting-edge technology like artificial intelligence, augmented reality, data analytics, and apply that technology to deliver better patient outcomes. I think digital health is going to be the future of healthcare generally. If we get the data right, and if we get enthusiastic people involved, then we're going to be able to get the outcomes that we want in our patients. And we'll be able to absolutely make sure that the things that will work well for our patients are being done more regularly. We have trained three budding digital healthcare scientists at our hospital. We've given them three real-life projects. The first project was about telemedicine. The second project was about enhancing the digital maturity in a very busy emergency department. And the third project was looking at the whole data flow that is needed for a learning healthcare system. They learned that they had to put themselves in the middle of the three players of IT, operations and healthcare. And I think they, they bring together the various stakeholders and the various players because they understand each aspect. So I think that's the value they, they give to the system. I'm currently working on a project looking into documentation burden and a need for digital maturity in the emergency department. So I've been looking at the electronic discharge summary and I've carried out a time and motion study and various usability questionnaires and gathered data to kind of devise recommendations to give to the directors at the hospital. And working here has allowed me to see how digital can improve patient care, reduce waiting times and overall service that clinicians can provide. Digital technology is what we need in order for our placement to run. And um, having said, our placement lead, also the CCIO in the hospital, has been amazing because he's been able to show us the importance of digital healthcare and technology within the hospital. So my project involves data mining, which incorporates Docobo and MySense. Docobo is a remote monitoring care system for patients who don't necessarily need to come into the hospital on a weekly or monthly basis. But what Docobo does is personalise to each user so that if anything um, which is abnormal, it will be recognised by the system, then triage, and we will send out the correct healthcare professional to access the patient. And what MySense does is also a remote monitoring care system but it uses sensors to check up on patients who may not be able to check up on themselves. So, for example, patients who have dementia. Part of my project is trying to help with the implementation of video clinics, and AQRX is the video consultation software that this hospital is trying to use. I managed to help the hospital by increasing the number of video clinics by 78%. Having a digital healthcare scientist is really crucial to fill in this gap to be able to provide a go-to person when you try to implement a digital solution. During the COVID pandemic has really shown us the importance of digital healthcare. And I don't think there has ever been a more important time to look at technologies that are deployed in other industries and start to look at how we actually deploy those in healthcare. So as the future of healthcare is digital health scientists, people who help the clinician manage the clinical data to improve outcomes for our patients. So I really look forward to working with the bunch of students that will become future digital health scientists.